northern YouTube. What's going on, everybody? This is Toby Northern here. Um, I've got some notes. I missed last week's world record poker run Wednesday tip covering energy boosters, drinks. We're going to cover our cooling vests, lip balm, and monkey butt. <laughs> Not a monkey's butt, but like, do you chaff? Do you chafe? So, the first thing we're going to cut, we're going to talk about is the energy booster. So, got some stuff here the last ride that my wife and I went on in from to Sturgis we left from here and went to Sturgis and then came back we both each had our own road glides and we're doing the same again with this world record poker run so um, some things that we brought with us and you can get these on Amazon you can get these at Walmart you can even go to your local running store you know and a place that had you know there's a running store there's one around the corner from us called the running soul s-o-l-e but you can find this kind of stuff which is some gels like energy gels and there's different flavors different kinds um, runners use these to replace electrolytes and give them energy for long distance running I've personally used them when I did a couple of the army 10 milers up in DC uh, put them on a, a belt that I had there's their pet straps for them or little connections for them and you just put them on your belt and you take them and you can tear them out and eat them it's just a gel and I would put these in my saddlebag or put these in the glove box of my bike or put them in the pocket of your jacket and you can you know rise your ride and if you're not wanting to pull off anywhere you can pull tear one of these or even when you're filling up and, and take one of these down and they're excellent for replacing energy giving you something for your stomach to, to be able to digest and just kind of like I say it's energy and it's a version of food so another thing you can also do is we used these also got these at that running store we also bought these on amazon we got these uh, as a result of being recommended by whit Mesa. she got these um i can't remember what they're, they're called nuns in you in you you in none hydration right these are lemon lime strawberry lemonade and cherry lemonade so these are little tablets that you can put in that you can put in a thing of water and they'll dissolve and they are great for uh, replenishing, keeping hydrated. I'll tell you on this ride you're going to, we're going to be going through the southern states and during the hottest part of the summer really probably some places are going to be 100 plus degree temperature so on that bike with that engine of heat underneath you you're going to burn through a lot of sweat and all that kind of stuff and those are going to be really good for replacing electrolytes so um, you've got the energy boosters and drinks a cooling vest i don't personally use one i've seen a lot of people that do we have them we just don't i just i'm not a big fan of getting them wet or, or having that thing on me so the concept behind those is you soak the vest in water you put it on under your jacket or a vest or whatever just under your clothing and it automatically gets cool and it will keep you cool until it dries up while you're riding same concept as those towels you've seen the people the vendors sell that you can crack them get them soaking wet in water and they will automatically cool down that water and you can put that around your neck as well that's another way to do it. we use that at rolling thunder in dc um lip balm Mama Badger mentioned this in one of their previous on their free, Friday free ride when they, her and Sonny were riding together. You're on a road trip. It doesn't matter if you got a full face helmet or a half face helmet, three quarters. It doesn't matter. With all that wind and that sun, and like I said in a previous video, we're going to be going due west for the, the major portion of the trip. Lip balm is going to be key. Otherwise, you're going to be getting fever blisters. You're going to be getting all sorts of chafed lip, chapped lips and stuff. So lip balm is going to be a key factor. You'd recommend it. I forget it sometimes and I end up paying for it later. Um, and the last thing, monkey butt. Monkey butt, for those that don't know, it's a popular rider use. It's a product you can get online. You can Google a monkey butt. And there's probably other brands. It's just the one that comes to mind. But for riding in that saddle over extended days, long miles, your butt's gonna chafe. chafe. You're gonna get rashes, you could possibly. So that's a great thing to use to put it in those 
sweaty areas to prevent chafing, prevent rashes, so that you're not uncomfortable walking around looking like a cowboy getting off a saddle. So, um, but those are the tips this week, or for the, that I was going to do this past week and missed. It's in, the energy boosters, drinks, the cooling vest, the lip balm, and the monkey butt. So again, great advice pieces there. Take them, take them if they're something you use. Um, we just want everybody to be able to enjoy and have a good time on this trip, ride safe, and I look forward to seeing everybody down there.